In this segment, you'll see how to assemble your new AgriFab Utility 12 poly cart. Begin by aligning the hitch bracket, part H, with the front hitch channel, part F. Then fully secure it with two 3 8 inch by 1 inch hex bolts, part M, and two 3 8 inch nylock hex nuts, part R. Next, insert a short clevis pin, part L, and secure it with a 5 32 by 3 inch hair cotter pin, part BB. Now align the assembly with the hitch channel, part G, and latch pin bracket, part B. Then fully secure it with two 3 8 inch by 1 inch hex bolts, part M, and two 3 8 inch nylock hex nuts, part R. Next, insert two 3 8 by 3 quarter inch hex bolts, part O, and fully secure them with two 3 8 inch nylock hex nuts, part R. Then repeat for the other side. Now thread the 3 8 16 hex nut part V onto the 3 8 1 and a quarter inch hex bolt part HH so that three quarters of an inch of the threads are exposed. Then insert the assembly up and through the hitch channel and secure it with a 3 8 inch nylock hex nut part R. Now insert the half by 1 and 1 8 inch hex bolt part Q through the clevis pivot part I. Then slide on a 0.64 by 1 inch washer part Y. Next insert the assembly through the tongue. Then slide on a 0.531 by 1.5 inch washer part Z followed by the half inch lock washer part X. Now secure it with a half inch 20 jam nut part W. Next align the tongue assembly with the axle assembly part C and insert the long clevis pin part K and secure it with a 3 30 seconds by 1.8 inch hairpin part CC. Now press a plug part DD into each end of the frame assembly part D. Then align the frame assembly with the axle tongue assembly. Next, secure it with two half inch by three inch hex bolts part J and two half inch 13 nylock hex nuts part U. Now align the bed. Next, insert 2 quarter inch by 3 quarter inch hex bolts part P with 2.312 by 0.374 washers part GG down through the holes in the front of the cart tray and frame assembly. Then slide on 2.312 by 0.734 washers part GG and loosely secure them with 2 quarter inch nylock hex nuts part T. Finger tighten only at this time. Next, slide on a 0.375 by 0.875 washer part EE onto a 5 16 by 1 inch hex bolt part N and insert the assembly down through the tray and frame. Repeat three times. Then slide on 4.375 by 0.875 washers part EE below and fully secure them with 0.312 by 18 nylock hex nuts part S. Make sure not to over tighten the bolts as this can lead to cart tray damage. Now tighten the two bolts at the front of the cart tray. Make sure not to over tighten them. Then insert a 3 16 by 2 inch cotter pin part FF and bend the ends out to secure it. Next, slide on a large washer, part AA, onto the axle, followed by a wheel, part E, with the valve stem facing out, followed by another large washer. Then secure the wheel with the 3 16 by 2 inch cotter pin, part FF, and bend the ends out to secure it.
Repeat for the other wheel. <laughs> 